Hello everyone, welcome back. Um, so yeah, the plan today is just to play... We're gonna start with swords and magic and stuff and maybe play something else later. Depends how we feel. Um, but yeah. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna, I think, go straight into the game. Because, uh... I don't know why I didn't just do that straight away. I can go on this screen instead, but you know, uh, I will. Look. Uh, there we go. We'll stop this music because the game has its own music. There we are. Um. Yeah. So the. Winter event is over now, um, so I guess we'll see how things have changed. Now yeah, we'll see the portal thingy over there is gone, um, and I've obviously still got my <laughs> festive items, but those are good weapons and stuff, so I'm keeping them. I always do that. I forget that it's not E to access my inventory; it's Tab. Start off by just watering the plants. Uh, right, there we are. Um, so a couple things I wanted to mention. Um, so as some of you may know, my streams after um, they're over, I do upload the VODs to YouTube. Um, and on the last one, I got some lovely comments. Um, with some tips actually about the game. So one of them was these companion snacks, uh, which I didn't, I, I mean I knew they existed, I just never really knew much about them. Um, but as you can see from the text, it restores a small amount of health over time to your animal companion. So I was talking about the crab last time um, and how I couldn't heal it because I didn't have my healy staff. Um, these work as that for the companions apparently. Um, I've yet to actually test it out. I only bought them last time. I haven't really used the grab much since. Um, but that is um, was some very helpful advice. And... Oh, I don't have it in my inventory. Where did I put it? Over here? Yes. So, Henrietta's Egg. I had um, the same person also commented about this. And I was mentioning how I didn't really know how to hatch it. I had like a vague idea of who to go to and the commenter basically said yep yeah, it, it basically is that person that I was thinking um, in the farmland so we will probably head there later to do that. Um, yeah very helpful comments um, and I realised I have not emptied my inventory. Uh, oh yeah I put some extra chests down because I needed them. Oh, it's all chest. And for some reason this sign is showing that. I guess it's because it's... Yeah. Don't know why it does that. It's weird. I might actually remove the sign at some point, but... Uh, right. What did I want to do with all of this? So, now that the Frostfall event's over, I'm going to just dump all of those into a chest because I don't need them but I don't want to get rid of them in case next year there's another frostfall event then I can use them then uh, oh I keep doing that I've got some seeds let's plant these There we go, and I realised I unequipped my water bucket. Harvest that. Oh, and this is really to harvest as well. If I can reach it, there you go. One, that one. Um, 
So yeah, these chests are a little bit more organised. This is basically vegetables. Um, this one here is basically fruits. This one is other things. This one is like the random stuff that isn't all edible. And oh, this, same one. this one is the like meats and milk and eggs and stuff and marshmallows because I got plenty of them. Uh, right, did I have anything else to drop off? Let's quick sort my inventory. I've just got a bunch of rubbish. Go sell some of this stuff. Don't need that, 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 that. Um, and then the forks that always get put up there. Good, and the rest of this goes in my storage. I wish there was like a sort button for the storages as well. That would be nice. just left. Never mind. We'll go to the farmlands in a minute. I didn't even pick up the egg anyway so it would have been pointless if I'd gone. Oh I got another seed from that. Nice. in here. Yes it was. Uh, right. Uh, if I'm going to the farmlands I should take that. Leave those in my inventory. I should probably take those out of my inventory actually. Snowballs, don't need them. I will However, chuck them in a chest in here because they're technically ammunition for the uh, slingshot. Right. So then, if I have a look at my thing, oh, okay. I guess I, I'll I'll leave that there for now. Um. Right, this one is the other place. This one is the other place. This one's farmlands. I don't have enough corn yet, I don't think. I had that equipped whilst I was doing stuff because I get a recipe from it. Uh, this is one that's from the farmlands. That's another from the farmlands. Farmland one. This is technically farmlands even though it says Sleepy Haven. That's part of the farmlands. In with that one. Oh yes, uh, that was the note thingy I picked up. I need to go talk to the person again because I couldn't figure out where it was last time. Uh, that one. Uh, oh yes, I need wool fabric. Can't make that yet, I don't think. Um, and then that one and That's here. I've 
I've got lotus flowers. Uh, I'll go and grab another one when I go there. Right, let's do this. Still on the way there, not on the way back. I was hoping it would be back on the way back by now. Actually, one of my quests was for this area here, this one. Da -da -da. Who I talk to? Talk to Captain Gill, wherever he is. I think he should be on this one. I think I know where he is actually. He's over this way. I think it might be this guy. Uh, it would help if I just get up there. Yeah, that's him. This is practically my tavern. I bet a single-handedly keep the lamps burning. It's my favourite place in all of Tirowin, next to my ship that is. Can I speak with you? Wait, are you from the guard? What seems to be the problem, officer? I'm looking into a missing shipment. Ah, you think my crew stealing the crates from the shipment? Well, I'll see you straight then. I'll, s I'll set you straight then. They're not satisfied. I just have a few questions. Ask away. How big is your crew? Just the four of us. There's me, Roxy, Fitz and Jenk. You can find them around here somewhere. We ship out soon so they wouldn't have gone far. Tell me more about your crew. Who do you want to know about? Let's go with Jenk. Probably do all of them but... Jenk's been with me for about a year now. He's a good lad, trying to pay his way to that magic school in Alarin, I suppose. I pay him what I can but the guy's a bit clumsy. I don't blame him though, he's still trustworthy and a hard worker. I'm just not sure he's going to make it through that college in one piece. I have more questions. Fitz. Fitz is my newest recruit, one tough sailor. He is. He is. A uh, real go getter too. He's been around a couple months now and really seems to love the job. Glad to have him aboard. Roxy. Where do I start? Roxy and I go way back. She's got a special place in my heart, as well as my crew. I wouldn't set sail without her. Smart, tough, and exceptionally loyal. Oh. Uh, hang on, let me just... I want to ask about something else. There we go. Um, have you lost cargo before? Only on this darned port. The last couple months we seem to lose a crate or two here. Sometimes it turns up after the fact and sometimes it doesn't. I'd be more worried but this is Azura, not the brightest bulbs working the docks here. Which dock worker unloads your ship? That would be Greg, he's probably hanging out near our ship on the docks somewhere. I'll see what he has to say. No, I wanted to talk more. No, I, I can't ask the other question. There was another question to ask. Never mind. That's Greg. Usually I'm complaining about having too many crates, but now I'm complaining I don't have enough. I'm with the guard. Oh, are you here about that missing shipment? Yes, tell me what happened. Well, you see, I'm responsible for unloading this ship here, but one of the crates is missing and this isn't the first time. Every time the rat tail crew makes delivery on the island, part of the shipment goes missing and I get blamed. Something fishy is going on here, but I'm definitely not part of it. The rat tails are up to something. I'm trusting you to find the truth. I'm not taking the fall for this. I'll do what I can. If I were you, I'd talk to Jenk, that sailor over there. He's the one unloading the ship to the docks. He'd He'd know where that crate went off to. 
I'm guessing this guy. Yep. You there, you're not supposed to be here. And we chat. Oh boy, are you the darn town guard? Let me guess, you want to know about the missing shipment? I just have a few questions. Let's get this over with. Tell me more about your crew. What do you want to know? Let's ask about the captain. Well, Gil's been captain of the Rat Tails for a few years now. He's been hauling shipments all over Terwin and beyond. A lot of merchants use him for his professionalism. He's timely and away and always gets the shipment there in one piece. I have more questions. It's Pitz has been with the crew for a few months now. He's done a bunch of voyages already, though. Real upstanding guy. Not really into Dizzy Juice either. He never comes to the taverns with us. Roxy. Roxy's Gil's first mate. She's been around since the beginning, I guess. Longer than me. She and the captain are real close. She could probably do the voyages all herself if Gil wasn't around. Okay. Tell me about the missing cargo. I know that that Greg guy has been in the sun too long. I counted the crates when we came into port. You can check for yourself on this manifest here. And when did you get into port? Last night. It was too late to unload the crates. All the dock workers were home for the day. And when I went to sleep, nothing was missing. So you can't prove it was Greg? Well, no. But no one else had access to the cargo except for Greg and our crew. So it had to be him. I don't think it was Greg. Well, Roxy is close to the captain. She'll be at the tiny tavern with him. Maybe she can clear this up. We're going to have to talk to the entire crew, aren't we? I'm assuming she's going to be in here. Uh, no. I wonder where she is. Oh, that's her. Are you the guard running around playing detective? Cute. What do you want? I'm busy. I just have a few questions. Let's get this over with. Tell me about your crew. The captain. Gil's the best captain I've ever sailed for. He's honest for one and that's hard to find on the sea. He also treats his crew with respect. I'll sail with him as long as he'll let me. Jink. Jink's a good guy. I mean, he's not the sharpest hook in the case, but he works hard. He's probably still over on the ship unloading the shipment from last night, poor guy. Fitz. We picked him up a few months ago. He's smart, pulls his own weight, and doesn't mind being paid barnacles for the work. I'm not sure what he's doing hanging around with us, if I'm honest. Oh, hang on. Oh, where's that missing shipment? I don't know nothing about any missing shipments. I've been here with the captain for the past few days. Everyone here can vouch for me. Jink said the shipment was all accounted for when we left the ship, so it wasn't any of us. Where can I find Fitz then? Fitz, probably around town somewhere. Heard he's got some sort of business to deal with at the Merrymaker Tavern. But I haven't seen him since we got here. I'll have a word with him. Yeah, you do that. Okay. Don't think this is that tavern. No, this is the tiny tavern. There's the other one. Up this way, I believe. Ah, come to question me about the stolen crate from the shipment, huh? So what do you want from me? I have a couple questions. Let's hear these questions. Tell me about your crew. Captain Gill's a pretty good guy. He gave me a job, got me back on my feet. I was a real mess a few months ago. I had nothing. But he also pays us terribly, if I'm honest. Poor Jenk, that guy's trying to get to that magic school in Alarin. He's been scrimping and saving everything he has, but on this salary, that's not much. Jenk's a real good kid. Kind of daft, though. He doesn't belong on a boat. 
but we do what we can for him. I'm just worried that he'll do something crazy. I mean, he probably won't, but he's desperate to get out of here. His dream is to become a mage or wizard or something. He's been looking for a way to make extra money where wherever he can. Ah, the captain's sweetheart. She's tough as nails, really knows her way around the ship, but if I'm honest, I think she's got a side business going on. No way would she stick around this long on the, these wages. Uh, other questions? You heard about the missing shipment? Yeah, Jink told me about it. Real shame. Whoever stole it probably made a good chunk of change. Where were you when it went missing? Oh, um, I was uh, talking to the mayor. You know, since I'm such a good worker and all, he wanted to reward me. Reward you for what? All the hard work I've been putting in lately. He says I'm a real asset to the town. Can you confirm this? I mean, probably, but he's the mayor. I doubt he'd remember some small fire like me. So don't go asking him anything just in case. Maybe I will have a chat with him. You don't need to do that. I don't even do anything... I didn't even do anything wrong. I had nothing to do with that missing shipment. I know it was you. Okay. <laughs> it doesn't give me the option. Okay, look, fine. Maybe I did acquire one of them crates from the shipment. But, you know, gotta understand. I barely make enough money to pay for food. Just let me go and it won't happen again. I have to report you. You're the worst. None of the other guards even suspected a thing. Why do you have to come along and ruin this for me? think over this way this guy's teak welcome back recruit any progress on your current job i know who stole the shipment <laughs> great work you're really proving to be a valuable member of the guard here on the zero so what did you find out um let's say this I see. Regardless, stealing is against the law and he will have to face the consequences. However, I will see what I can do about ensuring every working citizen on Azura has a living wage. You did some good detective work out there. Good job. Now that's dealt with. Are you ready to investigate the stolen toy? Sure. Fiora's grandson, Camry, claims that one of his favourite toys has been stolen. I know it doesn't seem like much, but we can't have these going around unpunished. I suggest speaking with Fiora first. It's not a good look for the guard if we start, start questioning children over a mis misunderstanding. Yeah, I might do that one later. I'm gonna go see if the boat's back. Well, it probably has been back and then left again in the time we, it took to do that. I thought that one wouldn't take very long. This is just running around talking to people. It's still over there. Oh look, it's heading back. So it'll be back soon. We just need to find something to do for a minute or two whilst we wait. Don't run away, you're one hit from death. Thank you. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. And then we just have to wait for it to leave again. Um. Hey, crab. There you go. Now you can get on. Might take a minute for this to leave, but we don't want to wait too long. Oh, there we go. went in the water I'm guessing. Like, I, I can still hear it here but oh yeah look it's down there you can vaguely see it in the water. <laughs>
Here we go, we are at the farmlands. There's anything in this hut. It's like a interesting place, but nothing here, at least not currently in this version. There's also new types of horses here. But I've already got one, so. And the place is not covered in snow. It was covered in snow for the entire like Frostfall event. But it looks nice and green again. Oops, I clicked the wrong button to get off my horse. There you go. Um, what was this? Uh, not something I could make, I don't think. I've not got level 15 carpentry. Ooh, there's a chest up there. I just noticed that. It's the first time I've seen it. Duh. Any jobs that we want to do. Nah. This is like the crafting area is like on top of all of these caravans. It's pretty cool. Where did I want to go for my quests? One of them was somewhere over here. We avoid this area because those things there are scarecrows that are dangerous. Um, this is, I think, who I wanted to speak to. Yeah. This is um, about the note wanted to check what she thought about the note. Well, I, d I did do this before, but I forgot what she said. Someone left a note for me on the wagon, so it wasn't Scarecrows after all. I guess I shouldn't have assumed as much. You know who left it? Hmm, I remember there was this farm who recently quit his job. What was his name? I think it started with a G. I'm sorry, I really don't know more than that. Thanks for your time. Okay. Um... So, if I look at that note again... Um, so he lives in Sleepy Haven now, um, and his name begins with a G, and he's a farmer. So we're going to have to head to Sleepy Haven and find a farmer with a name that begins with a G. Um, Sleepy Haven is this way. This is the um, access to the next area. Gotta like blow it up. And that's the materials required, which to be fair, I do actually have some of that, so probably should grab all of that at some point and unlock it. But I don't, haven't really spent much time in the farmlands areas, it is so. someone over here to speak to, I think. Okay. Ah, oh, this is like, they're gonna give me an almanac when I've high enough level farming level. Yeah, the thing is I've like, I've got a decent level in farming now, I just don't know what level it needs me to get. Farming, yeah, level four. Hey, come on. Let, let me have the thing. Uh, guess not. Oh yeah, there's this cool area of like housing. So if you're playing multiplayer, there's like four houses all together. So you could have like a little community. Maybe that's pretty cool. And then there's this like garden plot area. Uh, 
And get some more scapegoats over there, avoid those. Oh yeah, over here this place is like closed due to danger. I'll show you what that danger is. This guy. I wonder if I can actually fight him. You just go far enough away and he ignores you. I thought I wanted to switch up what I've got. Oh god, he's lost like next to none. Yeah, I can't really fight this guy. Tell me you lost. Yeah, he's, he's dead. Regening my mana on him. Okay, we go now. Now I regen the mana. Can I not interact with him? He's on zero health. my magic staff somewhere. Let's heal him this way. I decided to keep it in my inventory so I can heal him like out of combat. Um, but like in combat I'd have to just treat I guess. Anyway, what was I doing? Heading this way. Oh yeah, there's this fun area, Moonbury Farms. Um, with lots of stuff. So in inside this shed is where the big chicken is, but you can't actually go in there now. Ooh, eggs. I don't really have any use for them, but I'm still picking them up. This is the guy that, um, chicken. There's all sorts of interesting things here. Potions and other stuff. Yeah, cotton fabric, wool fabric. I needed some of that for the quest. Do I just buy it? Would that quest actually give me is a reward? Um, cotton seeds. I mean, maybe. I can't make wool fabric, I don't think. Not on here. So the only way I can get it is buying it. And there, I've got the stuff for the quest now so I can hand that in. Buy some seeds but I'm just sort of not really focusing too much on the growing of stuff currently. Ooh, I haven't got that. Noodle soup? I don't think I've got that. Uh, that's too high level. Nice to learn some new recipes. Let's see what those are. Nice. Uh, 
Okay. Yeah, so sometimes oops, these are low enough level that I can use them, and then other times it's like a level 21 that there's no point me getting because I can't use it anytime soon. Um, I do not need a hay bale. I don't need a pitchfork. Uh, seeds. Oh yeah, this is building things. Little sheds. There was a greenhouse at one point and I really want to buy that one and I didn't at the time. There's a cute little greenhouse that I can do farming in. Anyway, we carry on. <laughs> Music's finally come back. Person over there. They're not hasn't been previously. Oh hello, please be careful, these are active astral ruins. If you're not careful you could activate a portal to another plane of existence. I've never do something. Probably not implemented properly yet. And then this place here is um, Sleepy Haven, isn't it? <laughs> um, yeah, the city basically. need to run around and find someone with a name that begins with G. Town hall with no one in here. This, rather than like the small little things, there's like a proper big bank vault here. It's pretty cool. I'm just gonna do that to get rid of my crab from following me because he's annoying me. <laughs> oh yeah, this place, this is a magic shop. This is where I bought some spells before. Ooh, can you light? How expensive though, I don't have enough money. Cost five thousand. Then you can't go up there. Forget that. I'm wondering if maybe these also become books at some point, or there's plans to like put more in the game to give you more things to do, and then they'll add more, maybe. But now it's just the like two things, and they are quite often the same stuff. Yeah, the little market. Checking everyone. Next building. Oh yeah, this is a uh, building store. Yeah, there's the cat is that I've got. Uh, I'll just give. I just code. Interesting. Stairs, because why not? This is just a house. 
one home. Oh yeah, there's also this plot that you can buy is like to build on, which I think is pretty cool. of the town. Keep out. Okay. I don't think there's a way into this one. No, it wouldn't even interact with that door. More plots to plant in. This is the library. Fishing. Okay. Or is that the only access? Looks like it. The problem is all of the NPCs can be constantly wandering around. So there's no guarantee I'm going to be able to find them. I mean, eventually I will, but... Oh yeah, this is house decor. Is there anything I want? Please. Oh, that's interesting. Crafting lodge plans. I guess, like, shelters for, like, various crafting areas. But I wouldn't fit that on my current plot. Little gazebo, cute. There's artwork. Ooh, that's a nice bed, but I don't really have the space for it. Ooh, that's nice. Ooh, like a wall art. looking. Oh, there's a plot here as well. Um, we haven't been to this one, have we? Oh, we can't. Okay. Um, it was due to haunting. Okay. Bunch of buildings we can't enter. This is this guy's house. <laughs> Epoch collection. Uh, jewelry. Sure, I'll help you get rid of them. Nice, he gave me the key. using this pickaxe because it's got a better chance of getting good loot. Except there's no loot from any of it. Oh well. 
still fun to smash up the pots. I didn't even realise that had been a quest. Can we talk to him then? Hold on. has an upstairs but there's nobody here Some of the times the books like these are readable, so that's why I was like looking at it, trying to see if I could read it. Sometimes those stairs are difficult to get up. houses. Hey, museum? An empty museum. What's through this door? Outside again? Oh no, it's a little office. Oh, PvP zone. Interesting. I don't know if I actually get on the ladder. Hey, why why am I falling off of it? Okay. Place. 
She's just looking for anyone with a name that begins with G. So many more people out and about now. I found the person. Why did this have to be the only available job? All I do is paperwork all day. Is this your note? Hey, how did you get that? I left it for Millie. I'm a guard. Oh, I mean, I've never seen that note before in my life. Nice try. Okay, okay, fine. I never thought the guard was going to get involved over something personal like this. What's going to happen now? Pay for damages. Fine, but I only did it because of the mess they created. They better clean it up soon. Here's 50 gold, that should cover the damages. Now let me get back to this stack of paperwork. Woo, we finally found him. Literally the first place we checked as well. He wasn't here. I just check those again. I figured it would have reset. We had a few other quests around here to be doing. Let's do those before we head anywhere else. Uh, yeah, there's this guy that wants a lotus flower. There should be some nearby. Grab one, can take it to him. There's also like a house plot over there, which I do want to get at some point. Nice little area. to the centre. It's this dude over here. Here's the lotus flower. What else was there? Oh, that's the farmland's job board. Ah, oh, this one. Must menace. So, where is he? Over there. Is that this way? in this little wooden building. No. Last Minister's Journal. Day one, that dumb kip won't give me any free food and all the guards love going to his place so I'll need to find some plate someone else to steal from. No one can catch me. I'm the masked menace. Day two. Cynthia's lunch was so yummy except for the pickles. I'll need to find someone who doesn't put pickles on their food. P.S. Pickles are gross. 
Day three, tonight I'm going to sneak around Sally's house and look through the window to see if she has any pickles. If I don't see any, she'll be my next target. who we go back to for this. Ask the minister's journal, so he'll leave me alone because he doesn't like pickles. Well, that's good, I guess. He's going after Sally. Her house is right next to here. You have to stop the last minutes. As soon as you catch him, come back to me so I can turn him into the guards. I'll have to take him if he's caught stealing. Oh, and you should keep his journal with that you just in case. It might be helpful evidence later on. Hey. Is it this one that's Sally? No. Okay, which house is it? someone I've seen before. Um, I don't know, when am I supposed to catch him? <laughs> So it's like basically I just wait for it to be dark. I guess this must be the house. Makes sense. Don't think I was able to go in this one before. So just wait here. how long I'm gonna have to wait for though. I hope this is the right place. By the way, I'm sorry if the stream is lagging a little bit. I do keep getting notifications of the frames lagging but it's not like massive so I hope it's not noticeable. Um, it wasn't lagging previously and I don't know what might be causing it to lag. Don't really want to wait here for ages. Especially if it's not the right place. We just wait around. I mean it's night time. So I guess unless we look around for a Sally. I 
talk to this guy. Greetings, traveller. I am Azzy. Many would call me a mystical, magical magician. A caster of fine spells, even. Feel free to wander around my momentously magical menagerie. It is my duty to share magic with everyone. Okay, I'm guessing when the light things come on, that means it's night time. So maybe they'll be turning up soon. I don't know. I've never really had any like quest things that have been time based. Just wait in here? Is that what it's telling me to do? Don't know for certain if this is Sally's house. She said that it was Sally that was nearby, like one of the neighbouring houses, so it makes sense if it is this one. for ages. I guess I'll just wait here for a little bit. See if anything happens. It'll probably turn out that this is not the right house, but... I swear I saw something. There we go. And I thought I saw red um, pop up the window. Go mind your own business. Stealing is wrong. Stealing? I'm not stealing anything. What kind of adult accuses a kid of something like that? I should call the guard on you. Uh, I found your journal. That's impossible. That's locked away in my secret fort that no one will ever find or get into. I found your key. No, I have it right here. Oh, yeah, I forgot to add pockets to my outfit. Oops. I didn't mean to hurt anyone. I was just hungry and working is no fun. I had no choice. I had a choice. Just please don't turn me in to Cynthia. I can't get in trouble again. I'll give you my spare costume if you let me go and I promise never to steal again. Yeah, I I'm not letting the kid go. I don't need a costume. I'm turning you in. Okay. Okay. 
guess I could speak to her. the mask menace. Really? Great. You should hand over his journal and anything else important so I can prove to the guard that he was stealing from me. I'll take it from here. Oh. On second thought, or I lost the journal. That's alright. I'm sure there's enough evidence either way. Thanks so much. I found this while cleaning up. It probably belongs to the mask menace so you can keep it. That's it. Slingshot. That's that quest done. Um, I want to do those ones because they're more difficult. Um, that one's further away. This is the key one. That one I can do. Need to take the gold back that way. So yeah, let's do this one. Iron plate and nails. Into the clothing before I head out. Uh, I think it's off this way. Is it? It's general goods. What's in here? Pretty much everything you can. Really, Just general stuff. place. Um, although I did want to go to the bank to grab the stuff out of my storage. so much now I can go back to tinkering these look way better than the ones I made you can tell Nigel that I'm all good now <laughs> there it is see you've returned you be careful in the workshop I can't guarantee your safety if you go poking around I helped Vera nice um, ah, so you did. Good news then. Cornelius was able to repair the oven for Ella, so our debts to each other have been settled. Good luck to you and all your tinkering adventures. I want to become a tinkerer. Ah, unfortunately I'm not taking on any more apprentices for now. Vera is already far more than I can handle. So you do look like quite the go-getter. I'm sure you will be fine without my assistance. Give it time. Ah, I was hoping I'd get like quests or something. So I guess all I can do there. I think it's a bakery. Um, 
one like that. My oven is finally fixed. I appreciate all the help you've done for me. So ready to taste that delicious bread I promised? I'm ready. Here you go. Tell me what you think. I need to eat the bread. Oh, instant health, vitality and luck. Have you tried the bread yet? Please tell me it was the greatest bread you've ever had. It was delicious. Ah, I knew it. I spent so much time making that bread recipe as good as possible. I'd love to teach you, but I need to keep it secret. Instead, I'll give you another recipe. It's almost just as tasty, so I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Nice. Can I learn it? No, I don't have a high enough cooking level. The pumpkin pie. Anything else? No, okay. Don't get stuck. in there. Uh, this place... oh yeah, it's just that. I want to change how I look. This is all the food stuff that you can buy. Yeah, corn. Do I just buy what I needed for the quest? Why? I mean, there's only 16 here, so it's not even enough. How much would it be? Not that much. I'll buy it. And I'll buy more another time. Potions. You can actually like make potions and stuff. I haven't really figured out how to do that though. Um Yeah, I've got a quest that I've been doing. Other I have yet to do because I need to go into a cave with very dangerous spiders. I died the last time I went in there. <laughs> Right, what other quests did we have? That one I'd need to go back for, that one I'd need to go back for... That's the potion one. That one I need to go back for, actually that's on the way back so I'd do that one first. And those are also in the same spidery cave. Okay. We head back this way. That's the spider cave. As you can see, it's got lots of cobwebs. Uh, I think down here. Xavier. Does it tell me on the map where I need to go? Oh yeah, it is literally right here. So I am in the right place. Oh, 
I don't have cobalt key. Where is Xavier? Welcome back to the orchard. Sadly it's the end of the season so we don't have many apples to spare but soon we'll let people come pick their own. I'm picking up apples for Warner. Right, I was wondering where he was. Normally he comes by and picks the apples himself since lately my knees have been aching from going up and down the ladder all day. You look young and in shape, maybe you could just jump up and pick a few apples for me. I can do that. Collect apples. I'm gonna pick all the apples. I never noticed them before. Am I too far away? It's weird. Okay, got it. Have you gone apple picking in my orchard yet? I know my apple's delicious but don't need them all, I'll be watching. I have them here. Thank you for helping out, let me put those in a basket for you so you don't drop them. Uh, right, where do I go for this? Over there. <laughs> all the way over that place, the windmill. Another cobalt chest that I can't open. I have those apples. Great, just give me a second to get it all ready for you. And here you go, thanks for waiting. Sorry for having you run all these errands for me. No problem. Now, deliver Darius the pie. Ah, over there. This is the right place. Here's the pie. While you were gone, I saw something shining in the water below me, so I hopped down and picked it up. Can't believe it was an opal, so you can have it for helping me. Nice. things on this board. Eat, there we go. And then over here for the other one. Wherever she is. Now. 
house, I'm guessing. Georgie was responsible? Oh right, Georgie. Now that I look back on things, he did mention a fear of scarecrows. I guess I can see why he's so angry at me and my husband. Here's 50 gold for the damages. Thanks for your help. I feel safe in knowing there are guys like you around to help us. There we go. It's done. Talk to Harrison. Where is he? Over there, okay. I think this guy, yeah. Hold on. You tracked down the vandal all by yourself. I'm impressed, and you took care of getting me the gold to fix her wagon. Good work. However, still lots more guards guard work to get done. We keep getting more reports, and we're struggling to keep up. Want to get started on the next one right away? Lay it on me. Yezia, one of the residents over at the orchard, has brought it to our attention that her husband has been missing for several days. I've had some other guards look into it, though they haven't had any luck yet. I'd like you to join the investigation. I'll do my best. Go speak with Yezia first. Maybe she knows something new that she didn't tell the other guards yet. Right, what other quests do we have? I think husband, blah blah blah. Potions, that and that are all the same one. This, I just need a bit more corn. Okay. Is it this person? This is sometimes glowing and you can get across. I wanted to go across there because there's like time sensitive um, thing going on and I was curious to like I want to try and complete it. Right. I just have to wait. I have no idea when that is. Oh well, I'll do it another time. I'll try and keep an eye on it from wherever I can see it. This was dangerous in there, I think, as mentioned. Where am I heading for this quest? Oh, just down there. Gina with the guard. Another guard? Maybe you'll have better luck finding him. Any new information? Not really. Keegan, my husband, left a few days ago to go into town to pick up some stuff. What was he picking up? Some sort of mixture to spray on our tree to keep insects away. And who is he meeting? 
Farley, the owner of Farley Fine Potion in Sleepy Haven. I'll look into it. Okay, that's going back to Sleepy Haven. apparently a very big drop. Ah yes it is, I thought so. one thingy interesting right this was the time sensitive settings 9 p.m 1 a.m or 3 a.m 1 a.m is the next one that's Derby so we wait until 1 a.m is to speak to this guy. So we'll just wait here for now. Not got too long to wait. moving quite quickly so we won't have to wait long before we can talk to him. He knows who Darby is. Listen here, you are hoping I should call a guard from personally a member of the royal family. Ooh, royal family. Lucky for you, I'm too busy to go out of my way. Now you get out of here before I change my mind. Let me... Okay, the next one was three, right? I'll go through all of them until one of them works. Yeah, 3am Kent. too long. Lots of stuff in my inventory that I need to get rid of. time we met face to face, I believe you have some explaining to do. Yay, it worked. 
You told me the Majors College in Alloran City would be happy to fund my astronomy experiments, but now you say they've changed their minds? Uh, they spent it all on scrolls. Nice try, Kent. You see, I sent my assistant to meet with someone from the college and they said they sent the gold with you. So, where's my funding, Kent? I spent it all? I should have known better than to trust you. I'm reporting you to the college and the Sleepy Haven Town Guard. Good day, sir. Okay. Did that give me a quest? Debt collector. Find Ken. Okay, maybe that wasn't the one to go with, but I guess I'd go find this tent guy. Oh yeah, now I cannot go back into that area. It's a weird one. Um. Right, what other things do we have? Uh, that one... Sleep Haven. So these three. Uh, actually, let's click that. Um, are all in the same cave. So we'll go to the spider cave and try and do that. These aren't the right mushrooms, are they? Hey, let's get this dude. Then... Ones of these were useful. could be good. That didn't even hit it. Fuck's sake. was still there and moved. Die. Okay, it just can't be hit by a fireball apparently. <laughs> yeah, that thing's dead. Not surprised. Okay, yeah, fireball didn't hurt it. Uh, let's switch this to... myself sure. Oh, who's there? Um oh, fuck.
could slow them one at a time. Oh fuck. Needs another heal. Eat it. So, grab. So you stood on my loot. I'm gonna try another fireball. This one attack me. Okay, apparently the little ones. Uh. Yeah, skeleton help. Kill the spider for me. The crab is completely useless. Was a bit scary. Right, this thing. I gave you a thing. Thank you. I don't need to. Let's just do that. Doesn't cost quite as much. in the hallway where I'm safe. Why wouldn't it hit? So my crab is completely useless. Where's all the music gone? Fuck, do they respawn? I think they just all respawned. Bye. I'm leaving. Sake.
I'm going to go back in and see if they've all respawned in that bigger cave. Honestly, using the mason shield might be the better approach. There you go. Oh, fuck, that's the big one. Yep, we go through here. And we use some magic. Maybe stuck there. Okay, no more spiders on this bit. Up there, of course it did. I swear these guys are like teleporting around, it's a bit weird. Slightly buggy, I guess. Don't be able to damage me. There we go. Oh, it still managed to poison me somehow. big one there. Two big ones. Fireball. Okay. 
Uh, well, the fireball did a decent amount, and this will regen my mana so I can do it again. I wonder if the other one got badly hurt by it. Where is the other one? Didn't come down. There it is. Okay, yeah, that one didn't get fireballed. Oh, fuck, it didn't get stuck like the other ones. recovery for quite a while so I'll keep regaining health. Should have done that beforehand. I'm determined to make it through this now. Got on this far. There's one there. And another one over there. Fine, they can follow me. that for 40 damage that's pretty good honestly i think this mace actually might be just the better way to fight them okay yeah two hits from the mace and i can kill them so i'm gonna just stick with the mason shield actually for now As long as I kill them in two hits, I don't think they ha have the chance to attack me if they leap.
And that's everything in here that I wanted to grab. Oh, it's a person. Keegan, I'm free. I thought I was a goner for sure. I was just walking by the cave when a few of the spiders ran out and attacked me. They dragged me into the cave, but I managed to get free. I was hiding for a couple of days, waiting for my chance to escape the cave. When I finally made a run for it, they caught me again and spun me into this web, and it was and I was trapped. Thank you for saving me. Here, you can have this watering can to show my appreciation. Now let's get out of here. Nice. I thought it might be like someone trapped, but I didn't want to interact with it in case it wasn't. So I was done. Okay, there was another path that way. I'm not even bothering like getting any of the rocks just because I don't really need them. And this isn't exactly the safest place to, you know, mine. Uh, nothing up there. Okay. Let's switch back to magic for a second. I don't know whether this guy can actually get to me from here. So I might just be able to kill him. You want the music to come back. Okay. burning tick damage. Ah, there's another one down there. Okay, let's see. This is probably the best way to go down. I have a feeling I'm not going to easily be able to get back up. I can use the launch spell to get myself back up as long as I've got mana, so... Guess we go down again. Yeah, this is the kind of place that you're not supposed to go back up, I don't think. Uh, what? expecting it to spawn there. Health, please. Right. There's one over there. Okay. 
Shoot over here. Grab that. Shoot this one. Thinking like this means they can't actually get to me. This is a long way down. I'm not missing anything. Okay, so where's the next one? That's the next one down in terms of spiders. over there is yeah just rocks to mine the down I'm hoping there's another way out of here because I don't want to have to like launch myself back up every single step because you can't jump those I'm assuming they'd put another way out Most of these I can just shoot from a distance, which is nice. Oh, that one tried to get to me, but it couldn't, and now I can't reach it. There we go. See any more? I guess what type of stone this is? Cobalt. I haven't gotten cobalt before. I think it's safe to go down. Nope. And this one can reach me. And it's a big old spider. Although apparently it can't actually jump up to me, which is very lucky. Really hoping there's no more spiders around here. Some over there. Worked. Oh, my ended minions killing another one. I'm 
I'm killing them at range as much as I possibly can so they don't get near enough to hurt me. Oh dear, that's a lot of them. It's coming towards me. Oh fuck, another one spawned behind me. Fine, I don't have to go that way. Because it doesn't come towards me. It's kind of doing. reach and I don't have enough mana for another shot. to the fireball. No! Ow. Almost dead. There we go. Uh, what? Which one's heal? That one's max magic and health. That one's just recovery. That one's health and haste. I know, that spider died.
Did it detain? I thought it didn't for a second. Why did that hit in front of me rather than where I aimed? Please tell me that hit it. Oh fuck that one little one respawned. <sighs> okay, apparently I took poison through the shield, but that's fine. some mana on it. There's a lot of spiders in this room. spawn. Did hit it. There we go. Oh right, it was coming at me, I didn't even notice. to mine this as well because this looks like cobalt <laughs> I had another quest in here to retrieve a uh, snow globe oh no cult is in the cave this wasn't in here done that one and that one those are the ones that were in here. I'm curious if there's anything up there. Okay, that did not launch me anywhere near high enough. leaving. Okay, uh, what? What does it mean they allowed to hit me? Well, that's the spider cave done. I am never going back in there again. If I need to kill spiders, I'll kill the ones in the entrance. <laughs> also, I don't know how we're higher up than we were before. We went, we went up and then we went back down even further. But okay. Right. The potion one is in the town. Where's the other one handed into? This one. Let's check the map. Just over there. Yep, 
Yeah. Cool. More cobble. Let's grab that. And I think the quest gets handed in down here. Why did it have to be spiders? They're just the worst. I've taken care of them. You really did it. You're much braver than me. I guess that's why I'm just a farmer, but I'll finally be able to sleep peacefully without worrying about spiders crawling all over. Thank you. And finally, the music is back. So then, this one. I'll head back this way and hand this in and we've got I think some other ones in the Sleepy Haven to do as well. So much hopefully things will go a bit more smoothly now here's some gold for the ingredients and here are some of my other potions i made anything else okay i go for that one uh how many of my potions did i use up not too many oh actually some magic potions would be useful magic potions in. That's fine. What did I have? Oh, 17, so I need three more. That should be enough for the quest. Right, and who is the other person I need to speak to? one. I think there's also this one. Oh, the potion place. Okay, we need to go back into the potion place for this. Farley Fine Potions. I'm afraid my stocks are a bit bare at the moment. You know a Keegan? Why yes I do. Everything alright? He's missing. Are you sure? I heard someone found him in the spider cave. I think Harrison knows more about that though. Oh yeah, he's the guy I found in the cave. That explains it. I had to do that for the quest anyway. Uh... uh Yeah, literally, it's like I skipped a step by having already done it. Uh, right, so... Find Kent. I have seen him around here before.
Do we want to do any of these actually? This is another thing of finding a person in a town where they're all moving about. These awesome new clothes at Taylor. Having money is the best. Bird had sent me. What? He did? Oh man, this is bad. I didn't think anyone would find me. What was I thinking? Here, I spent some... Okay, most of it, but here's what I have left. I hope Bird's not too angry. And then I have to go back. Ooh, this looks nice. I like what I've got on there. Obviously, there's two of them. curious to see what that one is but I wouldn't be able to make it. Uh, right, any other quests here before I head off? Uh, this one I have to go back to the... I was. Um, da -da -da. Yeah. Actually, whilst I'm here, let's check for any Spell books. Launch or burst heal. It's the one I've already got. light. I think that's um, a special ore that doesn't show up very often so I definitely want to get that. Uh, I've only seen one before. It doesn't happen very often. See if this thing is open or not. How good it is. Listen here, Kent. Wait, I'm not Kent. What? You mean you posed as Kent? I got your gold bag. What? You tracked him down? Well. I'll say you're quite clever, you know. Thank you so much for your help. Hmm, since he seems to have spent most of it, I don't have much to spare as a thank you. Oh, perhaps this will fit. I just had 
new outfit made up, but my assistant got the measurements wrong. Here you go. Thanks again. Yeah. Do you have an appointment, adventurer? I found something. I bet you have, but I'm very busy. I don't have time to examine every adventurer's treasure. Carry on now. I think it's meteorite. What's that? A meteorite, you say? Well, I'll say that is a meteorite. Would you mind if I examine it a bit? I think this may be the key to finally opening that sealed door. Sure. This is great news. I'll begin my research right away and contact you once I've found something. If I get that door open, you'll be the first to know. I owe you the first look. Meteorite shards are incredibly rare. Yep. So that was... Wait for a letter from him. Okay. This one I need to go talk to him. Where is he? Out oh, there. The other side. Hey, hey, I heard from the other guards on the, the case that you helped get Keegan back from home safe and sound. He's really turning into an asset to the guard. I heard he was trapped in the spider cave. What a time we live in without the paladins. As always, here's your payment. Yasia contributed quite a bit of gold to thank whoever got her husband back. Happy to help. You know, you're doing a superb job helping me out. Such a good job, in fact, that the captain herself specifically requested you to work under her. Are you ready to join her already, or do you need more time before you're ready for this added responsibility? I'm joining her now. Fantastic. Go find her at the guard tower just up the hill from here. Her name is Cadence. She'll be expecting you. Nice. I haven't actually looked at this place. around first. Find anything interesting? Look at that house. Wood chest. I don't have a gold key. Ooh, there's a chest on top of there though. How do I get on there? Oh, this is the cells. Here's a tip for you. Don't get thrown in jail. It's not fun. Good tip. Oh, I got a letter. Hello Gina, I have fantastic news. The meteorite shard you left with me was indeed the key to opening the astral ruins. You must return to my camp on the hill in the farmlands. I have something incredible to show you. Nice. I'll do that another time. Please now. Is that the person I need to be talking to? Yes, it is. But I want to explore the building first.
figured I was going to take some damage there. It's fine. Hi. I've been waiting for you, Gina. I have an important job for you. What is it? I need you to deliver something to Cornelius in Sleepyhaven. We recently captured a bandit carrying a strange contraption and we need to have it examined. We don't yet know what it does, so be careful with it. Are you ready to start this now? Ready. Excellent. Remember, bring it to Cornelius. You can find him at the Trinket tinkerer's building in town. Yep, I've been there before. I think I will go do that. And I remembered I wanted to do the thing with the egg, which is over in the same direction. I keep forgetting every single time I go that way. see what there is I wanted to drop off in here. Okay. Uh, that can go in there for now. Same with that. Let's, I'll store that, why not? Um, materials can all go in there. Obviously some of that stuff doesn't actually go in there. I store it elsewhere but for now I will leave it in there. Just to clear up some of my inventory. Let's also check the food items that I don't want. Want that? I need to go and do the quest for that. I uh, don't need this one. What's this potion of luck? Uh, no, I don't need that one because that one was more resilience. That, that, that. Ah, it's full. Never mind. Want to sell some of this? Actually, want to see if there's anything that can go in here. So good. This. Sell to you. I don't need that or that. The bones or the shells. Pork. that I needed to give the corn to. I got all the corn. Thank you so much. I can finally take a break. I was worried I wouldn't be able to get a big enough harvest this year. Here, take this recipe as thanks. back over. Right, 
Right, who was I speaking to? Oh wow, I've got a very short list now. This one. Deliver that to the thing. Uh, I'm not going to do that one now. That one is not here. That one is the other place. Okay, this is the only one I've got. And then I'm going to sort out the egg. I need to remember that. So delivering this to Yeah, Cornelius at the Tinker's building. This is the Tinker's building. None of those people are called Cornelius. I swear that ladder was not there before. That's Cornelius. Okay. I need to explore. I haven't seen this level. Nigel put me up on the second floor because he says my inventions are dangerous, whatever that means. Special delivery! Ah, Cadence must have sent you. She sent word a couple of days ago that she had something for me to look at. Now let's see. Hmm, this is interesting. It's some amateur attempt at making some sort of trap. Who knows what those bandits are planning? The trigger isn't properly set up though. I could replace it for you if you bring me a couple of materials and then we can see what this baby can do. I'll get what you need. I'll just need a copper bar to make some new wires and an iron bar to replace the trigger mechanism. I shouldn't have put it all into my storage. I had those on me. I'll run to my storage and grab them. That way. Where is it? One iron. And one copper. It's supposed to be able to like split. Oh, that's how you do it. Okay, weird. It doesn't it only work some of the time. Here you go, give me a second. Got it, I'll trigger this from here, but I suggest you head outside just to be safe. I'll set it off once you're outside. To outside, okay. Good news and bad news, which do you want to hear first? The good news. I am completely unharmed. That is good news. And the bad news, this device doesn't even work at all, even with me repairing the trigger. Whatever these bandits are planning, it doesn't seem like they have the smarts to make it work. You better let Cadence know. I'll look into it this further. Maybe I missed something upon my first inspection. Thanks for the help. That's sorted. Now, it was 
somewhere up here. Over there, I think. I needed to go for the egg. This way. Get there this way. Oh, actually, there's a stables here. I know my thingy had a level up, so. Manage my stables. There we go. Let's move faster. Ooh, there's some walls there. Interesting. Run away! I was just looking around, thought. over here. Again for the help, I think the egg was quite soothed by the mud. I need your help again. Oh, again you say? Let me guess. This time it's a giant pig. I have this egg. Oh, well this is quite the turn of events. I didn't think a chicken of that size could actually lay in any eggs at all. This is rather extraordinary. What would you like to do with it? Hatch it. Oh, I see. Well, this is going to be quite the challenge. You'd best leave it with me. I'll do what I can for you. Before you do, are you sure you want to leave it in my care? Sure. All right, I'll write once I have news about the egg. Don't get your hopes up. Eggs this size generally need a thick, gale shell and the heat of their mother to hatch. What was I doing next? Yeah, I guess I'll head back and speak to Cadence. Let's have a little look over here. Uh, I should be able to fit through that. But uh, it's an invisible wall. This is obviously an area for the future. Yes. Bandit leader. At least he's not hostile. Uh, this area's got lots of dangerous things. Ooh, that looks like cobalt. None of them can get me up here. Oh, my God. 
stop running around, Bull. I want to kill you. Anything else? I jumped out and grabbed the loot. Oops. But they didn't chase me. This guy. Yep, the wolves are here. Thought they would had kinda chased me. Just hadn't chased me very quickly. I was concentrating. This chair will be the most beautiful thing you've ever seen, I swear. Now leave me be. Fine. I was trying to be friendly. seen that before. Guess I've not come this way. Oh, I have these one. Bees? Yes, bees. Bees everywhere. I just wish I could see them up close, but one isn't enough. I just want to give them all a big old bee hug. Buzz buzz, I want to be one up with the bees. Maybe I can help? I doubt it, the bees don't listen to me, but if you can find a way to get them out of their hive, I'll definitely reward you with something cool. I know a way to get them out of their hives. Honeycomb, anyway. At least to get loads of it. Thank you. 
bottles of honeycomb nice and easily. Okay, let's talk to him. Wow, I can't believe it. Did you see that? Did you see the way the bees gave me little kisses as they swarmed all over me? Buzz buzz. Actually, I think they were trying to sting me. Good thing I was wearing my fancy bee beekeeper outfit. Oh yeah, I guess you won that cool reward I promised you. Here you go. It's my spare beekeeper outfit. Now you can hug bees in style. Does it actually make you immune to the bee stings? That's what I want to know. Come test it. Oh my god, it makes you immune to the bees! That's so cool. So I can just put this on and get the bee honey. The honeycomb rather. Without having to worry about getting stung. Need to remember that one. I will add it to my collection. So I always have it on me. That's pretty cool. My house is not like going over this way. Okay, yeah, it's stuck. Come here if I really need it. What are we doing? We're going back to talk to Cadence. She got distracted looking around. I could probably have gone up the other way, but it doesn't matter. I'm going this way now, so it's fine. Will she be outside like she was before? Yes. So, what have you found out from Cornelius? The device didn't work. The bandits attempted to make some sort of trap. They're certainly becoming more daring. I'll give them that. Lucky for us, it seems they don't have the skills to pull it off. Puts my mind at ease slightly. Good work getting it checked out. Here's your payment, as well as a new uniform to signify your new role here in the guard. Keep up the good work. Thanks. I need you to look into something else for me, though it's not as much of a rush. Do you have time for it now? I can do it. There have been com complaints from the vendors at Moonbury Farms that some of their goods have been stolen recently. I'll have to ask around and see what you can find out. On it. Thanks. Uh, I am going to take a quick break and run to the bathroom. Um, I will be back in a few minutes. Uh, let me just do be right back screen there. Okay, see you in a few minutes.
Okay, I'm back. Go back to the game. Sorry, that was um, quite, kind of a sudden break. I just really needed to go to the bathroom. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to do this quest now. I don't really want to. Could try this. Although, to be honest, I might actually uh, switch game and play something else now. Because yeah, so we've been going for this for three hours. Might be good to take a little break from it and play something else. I've got other games to play. It's a few I wanted to um, try out on stream. over to this screen um, whilst I do. I should I, I kind of decided whilst I went to the bathroom that I wanted to stop playing but I should have just uh, decided that's like not played the game again. Thing. Okay, quitting out the game. It'll just take a sec and then I'll load up another game. Okay, so in terms of options for games to play, uh, we could do some Vicera cleanup detail. Uh, that's one I want to try out streaming. Um, I played it for the first time the other day um, with some friends, including Skelly, who was streaming at the time because um, she recently got affiliate, so it was her little celebration stream and played lots of Vicera cleanup detail. And that was very fun. Um, other than that, there's like a couple of games I have actually considered starting of like a more long term like playthrough thing, like Forager, Stardew Valley, Supraland, all those three maybe streaming, um, like a playthrough thing, um, and maybe only doing that only on stream, for example. Um, if there is anyone watching that has an opinion on what I do, let me know in the chat. Um, otherwise, I'll probably just pick something I feel like doing. I would like to do more House with Prom stream, but that didn't work very well last time. Um, and since then, I have played quite a lot of the game and um, basically completed most of the missions. Um, Um, let's go with Vicera cleanup detail. Give that a go, see if it plays well on stream. Because I don't know if it will. Just boot it up. It might take a moment. Oh, that was very loud. Glad you guys couldn't hear that. That is actually deafening. Yeah, okay, now in the game it's fine. Okay. It was... Yeah, I need to be more careful when I boot that up in the future because it was loud. Um, unfortunately, this full screen mode for this game is very annoying. I have to alt-tab to go out of it and it minimises the game. There we are. And then, oh, there we go. Uh, I think my settings are all on the lowest. I'd love to play this in window mode because I like, I prefer window mode for anything possible, but it's a really small window that doesn't take up the entire screen. Um, yeah, most things are on low. Or switched off. Ooh. And audio. Now that I'm actually in the game, it's fine. 
Okay. Uh, that assignment. We're gonna go solo. Uh, Supervile none. Game type. Clean up. Work site. Okay. Game rules. Time limit, footprint limit, but yeah, whatever. Um, okay, we don't want one that's going to take that long. We want a shorter one. We want a size small. That's a large, large, small, maybe that one. Although it still says an hour. Uh, medium. We want something that basically says either an hour or, or less. Because um, I don't know. Because it's probably going to take me a while. Yeah, it's yeah, this one's got the um, best performance. One. This is one of the ones we played um, with Skilly on the stream. Uh, that's a large, that's a medium. Very many smalls. Yeah, and this is the other one we did. Um, oh, so that one took an hour and 30 minutes. What did uh, this one take? Two hours. Hmm. Um, eh. Large. Large. Small. There's legacy. Um, that looks like things are floating. Maybe not that one. Oh, this one looks good. There's 45 minutes. Uh, how about that one? That one says an hour and that one says an hour. Yeah, well, let's go with this one. It might take us more. Um, and 45 minutes. Make take us less. Not we'll do one of the other ones. They're small. That'll work. Okay. Brief. The cleansing of this section of the facility is of the utmost urgency. Ventilation is to be turned off by tomorrow as many alien spores were discovered in the duct work the source of which was found to be this area. Failure to clean the area will result in access doors being sealed and the ventilation systems isolated from your area. Company advises you to consider the lives of other technicians in the course of your duties. The needs of the many outweigh the needs of the person in scrubs. Okay. Right, so the water bucket thing, this, I'm guessing that spinning, okay, oh, a broom, take it I might need one. Um, okay. Right, so this is the water area. Where's... Rubbish thingy. Ooh, there's USB there. We'll pop that in the machine. Another USB. We're doomed. Okay. Um, oh yeah, that's the thingy to get higher up. Ah, the music. Definitely want that. 
this thing. Okay, where's the incinerator? Ah, there it is. I won't incinerate any of the boxes or things until I know if they're going to be needed anywhere. Wait, those can be lifted? Okay. Interesting. I guess those have to be removed and burned. There's another USB. Okay, this is a crates area, so we'll stack crates up in here. Is this? And that's a place to stack up barrels. Okay. This place is fairly small, which is good. Okay. So I'm going to use this one to collect up the USBs and put them all together. this up. No. Oh yeah. Let's put it here so we can hear it in most places. Two USBs over here. the other one go there. I can't see any more USBs around. How's the stream doing? Are we lagging at all? I'm getting some reports of a little bit of lag from Extreme Labs, but not too bad, hopefully. Um, oh, there's a light here. That's useful. No! Well, that's rubbish now. isn't one of the things to get like lights and stuff. Also I, there's no medkits around as well. I don't have to fill any of them in. Yeah I think this might actually be all of the USBs. Not very many. Doing it in one of these means I can carry far more. Very dark. I literally cannot see anything here. That's rubbish. Cannot see. Come on. 
Win. They're not working. Okay. Do. Oh, punch out. This is once you've done. No, I'm not done yet. I was just checking the machine. Oh, there's that option. Right, I'm going to start filling this with rubbish. I'm supposed to put these anywhere. Anyone watching knows like what I'm supposed to be doing with some of this? Like, do let me know. Um, I'm gonna need another bucket of water at some point. There isn't really a tutorial for this game, which would be good of like Hey, this is how you play the game. You clean things, you put rubbish in there. This is how you get more water if you need it. Um, this is what you do when you see have spaces for crates or barrels. I learned this from playing it with some friends. I think that's on top of something. Because it's so dark, I'm having to like literally just see if I'm hovering over anything. Uh, need to be careful that I don't fill up too much that I lose stuff when I move it around. Should be good for now. A bit more of this. go burn all of this. what I might do is go to the other end and start from there. I'm stuck on something?
do not like that these lights are flickering. there. Yep. I just realised I forgot to change what game we were playing in the... on the stream. Uh, silly me. It's not going to let me change it now. Hang on a second. I just have to literally load it up in another tab and hope that it lets me do it in that one. I'm changing categories. Don't do it often. Go. All sorted. And resume. There you go. see the floor. Let's turn up my gamma a little bit. Okay, that looks like I'll actually be able to see it now. Yeah, I can actually see the ground now. The light areas are very bright, but I can see Mostly. Some spots are still quite dark. God, this fog is the problem though. It's actually making it even harder. Oh my god, that's a light. Let's turn the gamma back down. I'm gonna leave it on one, because then that I think is still really good. I still see things. Oh my god. There was a light there all along. Very careful with this one that I don't smash it. Oh, did I miss these ones?
Okay, that's all the rubbish in this section. dogs barking. Uh, we need to clean up this area and now we can hear the music nicely. Once I've got everything from this area I will throw this in the incinerator. It's getting kind of full. don't have anywhere to go do they? We just throw them in the incinerator. I'm assuming that means this one is an item that needs to be incinerated. doesn't fit. Ah. Uh, help. Okay, these don't fit in the incinerator. So, that doesn't work. I know that was what it was doing there. I need to grab a second one. Behind the barrels, good. Like that, no. I don't know whether I actually need this. Cause it's just to get up higher and I don't know whether there's anything high enough. Oh, actually I might need it to get that. Oh, 
Oh yeah, there's also blood all the way up there. I'm not going to be able to reach that. Incinerate this one. Chuck that in the thing because it'll not easily fit inside the thing. these boxes out here because they need to go in here I need to make sure the place is clean first oh, it knocked over that I think nothing fell out actually I don't think anything did that's good are these boxes able to get dirty I don't think they can like even though they were sitting sat like where there's blood, they are fine. So we won't have to worry about cleaning them. all those bits. And there's none more over here, is there? There's all of those bullet casings. Is now all of the items. Hey. Now 
start cleaning. I'm gonna move this up here because I'll start this side. I'll clean like that bit and this bit and then I'll leave this obviously because I'll need to keep coming back and forth. Actually, I should take a water bucket down with me. Actually, I should clean the areas for the boxes and barrels first and put all of them in them. That would make sense. This area is clean. I didn't mean to throw that. Okay, so this is for barrels. I should go and get another bucket of water because my feet are dirty and I'm going to have to walk into that area. should be enough to last me for a bit. Actually, are there any other areas for like barrels and stuff? Is it just these two places? Let's put this over here. Let's go grab the barrels from the other area. That box is in the way. And I'm stuck in it. this back down over here so I can actually hear it.
This doesn't say there's any space for houses there, no. Great, I suppose. And that isn't an area for them either, so they all have to go down here. There's no more in the other area. There's one here, and that's it. Clean up at least some of the area. It's a chance for me. Making a mess. There are the barrels over here. To grab the ones from over here. Barrels sorted. Oh no! frustrating. I just finished cleaning that floor as well. But I suppose at least I found it then. All the bits. Okay. 
both of them are off on that one. I wonder if there's any more around. I think that's clean now. Wait, you can brush up the footprints? Did not know that. I'm trying to move that. Okay, I didn't really just hit with it. Um, okay. Let's start piling them in. Oh, there's a thing there. Oh, I'd gotten it all. Right. Big boxes. smaller ones any really big boxes over here there's one Wanted to stack it on top, try and carry both at the same time. Kind of works. Oh, 
it's closer than it was. Um, yeah, I don't think I can fit another one on there. That'll do. sure I don't leave any footprints anywhere in there, especially when I'm putting boxes down. Hopefully they're all going to fit. I suppose I can burn some extra ones. Matter if it's really stable as long as they stay in there. And there's one there, one there, and then these two. Uh, actually, was there any more over this way? Yes, there was this, these two. Whoa. No, don't break the lantern. Come on. Shove it forwards. feeling these aren't all going to fit. Actually they might, there's not many left. There's one more over here. Yeah. 
There's none over there, is there? These fit. Yeah. paying attention to how dirty the mop was. I've got two more to fit. Nope. Basically throwing it on top. Theoretically, there are no objects left, and these don't need to be gotten rid of, so I can just leave those. No objects left. So it's just dirt. But there's a lot of it. There for now, because it helps light up this area. And that bucket's dirty. Rid of the dirty bucket and then I'll grab another one. And the reason I'm not running 
is because then I will probably spill it. Those look like footprints. Like some kind of animal. It was obviously walking on the ceiling. Kind of cool. Let's move the light so we can see better. trying to clean the floor. Now I'll continue with the ceiling in a minute. I want to be able to walk through here without getting dirty feet again. Don't tip it over. That's dirty. See now I put it in the light. the light. Mm. Well, I need to do these bits. There's an item up there, isn't there? There is something up there. I'm going to go get the lift thing so I can actually see. I swear I saw something move over there, so there might be some item but it's weird that it wasn't coming up on the sniffer it's fucking it jammed yeah there is something there But 
it's stuck. I literally cannot move that. It won't let me even let me grab it. I'm not even registering on the sniffer actually. Which is odd. Probably because it's bugged out or something. Make sure the area is clean at least. Oh, is that, that? Yeah. Come on! Yay! Yep, I knew that was going to happen. Won't let me jump off of this thing apparently. For a sec whilst I finish cleaning this bit. There's no body parts in there. Yeah, there wasn't any other things along there. is basically done. Putting that body part in there is easy to carry. this area.
Oh no. We're putting the body parts in that. Oh, for God's sake. through this in the furnace. Caught it before it landed on the ground. I could just tell from the sound that it was chucking one of these out, like a body part out instead. Oh, I got very lucky there, it would have made a mess. so there's nothing behind it. Okay. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna like mop through from here now without walking over so when I dirty a bucket I'll just like leave it here. Then I won't get dirty feet over anything. Oh fuck. Dirty.
I think it's on the ceiling here, right? That one. That one's got blood in it. work if it's uneven. even clean that one. So I suppose I can probably do it on the slope. I just need to figure it out, maybe get it as even as possible. I just threw that body part on the floor, I shouldn't have done that. Probably made a bit of a mess. Oh well. There we go. enough height to reach it. A jump. That worked. Kinda. move that thing out of the way now because I don't need it in this area. Assuming I don't. I still already open. Too dirty. Out the way. Take this down the bottom because I've got space on the floor to put it. I want to put it on the stairs in case it fell over. We'll start by going this way. Less dirt this side. Let me 
He's closer. I haven't been walking over this side as much, so I haven't made as much of a mess. It's just mostly what was already here. Oh no, there's body parts. Wait. I'm going to try and drop them in a pile so they have less space to clear up. that bucket for them. Of course I'm tracking dirty footprints around again. Which I can do about that. Bash the wall with it. move on to the next bit. It's closer. Well, actually, I'm thinking I probably need to go and eat some dinner soon. We're almost done, though. I'll try and do it quick. I 
I thought it was not ready yet. No! Yeah, I, uh, to be fair, I do clean in real life. I just don't like to clean in real life. Stretch. Yeah, I probably should. I can sit in the same position for ages. I <sighs> hydrate. Sure. probably gonna have to actually end the stream in a sec because um, my mom's probably cooking dinner <laughs> don't think I'm gonna have time to finish cleaning all of this ah that's all right yeah it's nice of you to pop in probably get rid of some of these dirty buckets. Yeah, this is too much for me to clean in like five minutes, which is probably all the time I have. Um, which is a shame. Because um, I did want to get it done. Ah, oh, that's very nice of you. Thank you. Yeah. Well, I, I guess I'm just going to have to finish this off stream. But definitely we'll be doing more playing this game. I hope it's not been too laggy, even though I'm still getting notifications of lagged frames, but unacceptable. What, the lag is unacceptable or the fact that I have to finish it? Stream after I can't. Once I end the stream, I'm done. I've been going for like four and a half hours. And I've got other things to do. It's the only reason I was able to stream this late is because um, my D&D got cancelled. Which is sad, but also means I can stream longer. This was otherwise only going to be like an hour long stream. Yeah, we haven't played d, &D in ages because just, you know, first lots of Christmas stuff and then DM is busy with uni work, so like, yeah, can't really play if there's no DM. I did consider running a one shot and I did offer to do that, but DM said no. What do you mean? I oh IT crowd. I've never watched IT crowd. Ah, 
another dirty bucket. Just pop that one to the side. <laughs> okay, I'll take your word for it. I've got all of that and that. I don't think I have time to do this. Shame, I really wanted to finish this on stream. <laughs> See if we could. I just keep going though. Like I, I keep saying I'm gonna stop, but I just keep going. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and get it done. I think. And if and if I get told food is ready, then I will just end the stream suddenly. Um, but we're gonna try and finish this as quick as we can. to get water. rushing so I'm trying to mop too much and that's making things take longer. <laughs> okay there we go, the, the way to that is clear so I can chuck these buckets in. Quite a few dirty buckets to go in now. As long as I don't spill any of them, we're good. So let's move this down so I can hear it better. Finish cleaning up. Okay. 
You don't need too many more buckets. move all of these out of the way because there's probably dirt underneath every single one of them. burn these but they don't fit I think this is the last area of blood that I need to clean up get away with just this one bucket and I need another one. No, that's dirt. Let's make sure this thing's clean. I think that's it. apparently still dirt. I don't even care because I need to go. I, I don't even know where the dirt would be. There's obviously something somewhere, but that's it. I'm done. That's as clean as I can get it. I can't find where the rest of the dirt is. Um, as your janitorial work here met the requirements of the company as well as your own high personal standards, um, I'm proud of my performance and certainly will meet you with approval. Let's do that. See how we did. Exceptional employee of the month. Nice. What percentage do we get? 102% performance. Nice. It took an hour and 33 minutes. It said it would take 45 minutes. But that's fine. Um, yeah, we did it. And I'm going to have to end the stream here. Because I'm pretty sure my food is almost ready. Um, so yeah, let me just I 
exit the game. <laughs> Find the button for a sec. And then I will have a look for someone for us to raid. Let's see, who among the Goblin Grams is live, I wonder? Oh, quite a few people. Let's see. What are peeps doing? Oh, loads of people are live. Um, who's playing what? Um, you know what? Let's raid Fushbar. I don't think I've raided her before, or if I have, it's been quite some time. Um, yeah, Fushba is part of the Gobs and Grams, which is the stream team that I'm part of. Um, uh, yeah, so she is currently playing Vault Hunters, which is a Minecraft mod pack, if you've not heard of it. It's pretty cool looking. Um, Yeah, I will start the raid. And yeah, send you guys on over there. And yeah, I will, Um, I don't know when I will next be streaming. Probably, oh, I don't know, maybe, maybe tomorrow? I might have some time tomorrow, actually. Um, we'll see. I might do like a short stream tomorrow or something, because this was quite a long stream. Um, and then other than that, uh, I don't know when I'd next be able to stream. I'm trying to think when I'm working this week, I can't actually remember. Um, let me check my calendar quick. Uh, oh, Sunday actually, I'm not working. So I might do a stream Sunday afternoon. Um, so yeah, one of those two, otherwise probably next week, Wednesday or Thursday. Um, but yeah. I hope you all had a nice time here today and I will see you all next time. Bye bye!